Hello, everyone. This is a segment that we do on monthly episodes of Let's Talk Manufacturing South Carolina, and it is called From the Factory Floor. This segment gives us a chance for me to talk with a plant manager, maybe a facility manager, maybe an engineer, or maybe a techie guy uh, while they are actually on the facility floor. And today I'll be joined by Chris Clark. And Chris has a really cool sounding job. He is the robotics director for North America for Staubly. Now Staubly, they are a global mechatronic solutions provider. They have offices in about eight countries stretched around the world, but you know what? Their North American headquarters is just up the road in Duncan. Now, before I get to Chris though, I do wanna give a shout out to our friends over at HTI or Human Technologies Incorporated. They are the presenting partner for this and all the segments of from, from the factory floor. HTI began as a professional uh, recruiting firm for auto manufacturers back in 1999, and today they stu still do professional recruiting, but they also handle uh, executive searches, uh, industrial staffing, and a wide variety of HR solutions. They do a little bit of everything. They are experts in helping their manufacturing partners attract top talent. And uh, in this day and age, when workforce challenges uh, are big, uh, folks like HTR are extremely important to our manufacturing community. Uh, so anyway, appreciate those guys. Thank you to HTI for helping make it possible for us to bring this content to the South Carolina manufacturing community. And now I am joined by Chris Clark. Again, Chris, the uh, robotics director for North America. Now, uh, Chris, when I look at you there, what is that over your right shoulder? What am I looking at? That would be our TS-260 aseptic robot utilized in the semiconductor industry. Well, we're going to talk about all kinds of fun stuff today about robots and cobots and everything. Uh, but before we get into that, let's talk about Staubly for a second. Now, you guys are a big, big company. Uh, you have, uh, you're doing business in about 30 countries worldwide, but now you are located at the Duncan plant. Tell us about the company a little bit. Sure. So Storley Group was founded in 1892. So we've been around a while in Switzerland. We have offices in 28 countries and we have agents in 50 additional countries. So that's on four continents. We have around 6,000 employees worldwide and we consist of four divisions. So those four divisions, fluid connectors, electrical connectors, textile, and robots. So our robotic division is, is what we're gonna dive into today. So Stoibly is a leading player in the global robotics industry. We're known for having high performance robots, high performance software, aftermarket services across all the sectors of markets. Yeah, I tell you what, you're a lot bigger than even I anticipated, but I wanna go backward for a second. You said that Stoibly started in the late 1890s, is that correct? That is correct. We started in the textile industry. So the textile industry, which is why we're here in Duncan, South Carolina, used to be the headquarters of North America for textiles. And the textile machines that we build were what really put Stoibly on the map. Yeah, that is quite interesting. Now, you have told me something I did not know. Most everyone watching this uh, from South Carolina is going to know that South Carolina was driven by the textile industry all those decades ago, and you all were right there as a part of it. Man, that's a good piece of trivia. I learned something. So tell me what, uh, in relation to what I'm seeing there behind you, what is it that you all manufacture? Give me that rundown. As the director of North America, um, my responsibility is to develop and share a roadmap and strategies um, are executed according to our guidelines and our, our uh, path forward. So ensuring we have products and services customers and partners require um, for all of their manufacturing and integration needs. So what do we manufacture? Stoily offers four and six axis robots in a broad range. Four axis robots are ideal for tasks requiring very high precision and high speed, such as pick and place, packaging, assembly, um, the six axis robots, these offer great flexibility and movement, making them suitable for complex, complex tasks, uh, excuse me, like handling, machine tending, assembly. Um, in addition to our standard offerings, we're really well known around the world for our special environment robots. And by that, I mean our hu humid environment, our HE as we call them. These are robots designed to operate in humid and moist conditions with materials and coatings that prevent corrosion, 
um, and resist some of the harshest cleaning and washdown requirements like the food processing industry requires. Um, our Sterically models, similar to the one behind me, these are tailored for applications requiring very high levels of cleanliness. Typically, these are aseptic conditions in pharmaceutical, semiconductor, the medical industries. Uh, they can be thoroughly cleaned and sanitized without compromising performance. You know, Chris, uh, it's no surprise to you or to anyone within uh, the manufacturing industry that one of the biggest challenges that you face today uh, is workforce issues. And uh, it's hard to find people. It's hard to find good quality people. And because of that, there are a lot of folks who are beginning to automate their manufacturing lines more so than they have in the past, just because it's easier to make sure that the robots wake up in the morning and don't call in sick, right? But, but you guys can assist with this. Chris, tell me how you do it. So really, by leveraging our expertise and technologies, all industries can benefit from increased productivity, right? Accuracy, reliability in their manufacturing process is, is really key. So our robotic solutions, we address these with specific requirements uh, resulting in improved operational efficiencies, increased productivity. They allow clients to really be more competitive and reduce costs. So our, we help customers grow their business thus making it possible for them to hire additional people in supportive roles um, and thus adding more automation and continuing that cycle of growth. There's got to be a whole lot of options that people can choose from. I mean, I would assume that there are as many options as you can think of in terms of the types of uh, not only the product that you provide, but the services you provide. So if you're sitting down with a potential client and they are wanting to talk about this wide array of services. Where do you even start, Chris? Automation options are vast, absolutely. While some applications are fine with a standard robot, in many cases, customers are looking for a performance and precision edge. This is where Stoively excels. So in some cases that require a customized approach, first we begin by thoroughly understanding the specific needs and challenges of each and every client. Everyone has a little different. This typically involves a detailed consultation, to identify the pain points, the production goals, the specific requirements, our team of automation experts, then assess the process and workflow and recommend a tailored solution. In some cases, we'll work directly with our integration partners to provide the full turnkey solution that's required. So we provide demonstrations, feasibility studies, pilot projects to show our robots can enhance productivity accuracy and reliability and we can all do that here in duncan south carolina how many folks do you have in uh, at that facility and how many uh, is there only one facility or is there a couple so we have a couple of facilities we have this is our headquarters um, our headquarters for fluid connectors robotics and textiles are all out of this facility we're roughly 250 employees uh, we're well over 250,000 square feet um, so we're, we're very well equipped here, and uh, I, I think it's worth taking, taking a look and, uh, and providing you with a tour. Chris, thank you, folks. That is Chris Clark. He is the Robotics Director for North America for Stoibly. Uh Sounds like he has a great job. One I wish I was smart enough to have myself. Folks, uh, that completes another segment of From the Factory Floor. Uh, you can check out all of the From the Factory Floor segments on our YouTube channel, Thanks again uh, to our friends at HTR Human Technologies Incorporated for making it possible for us to bring this content to you today.